snake? Hush. That's right. It's her. What about the bomb? We were able to remove the explosives. Both of them. Bomb! No, no, no. No, it's okay. There's another in my... It's all right. We got it out. There's another in my... The guided tour will be wrapped up by the time you get home. Make me proud. By the time they leave, I'll have the IAEA praising us as the poster boys for world peace. Out. Something's not right. Check her again. Somehow she managed to survive. Anyway, the shock triggered some kind of amnesia. Snake, where is Professor Galvez? You mean? Yeah. She still thinks it's 1974. She's got no memory of anything before that either. The cipher, the KGB, nothing. It looks to be a kind of dissociative disorder. Dissociative amnesia, where memories are blocked out to protect the mind, and dissociative identity disorder, where the whole personality changes. What we're seeing seems to be a combination of the two. She truly believes she's nothing more than a student living in 1974. Peace Day was a lot of fun. I hope we can do it again. <sighs> she doesn't respond to anything that conflicts with her internal timeline. Doctor's pretty sure she's not faking it. If she had her memory, just think what she can tell us about Cypher. The photo is from that guy you brought back the other day. From the old crew. I thought it might jog her memory, but no luck. Anything else you can show her? Something to show me, Snake? I give up. She's all yours. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. Snake! Got something to show me, Snake? This photo. It is from 
the other day, right? I like it a lot. I look kind of silly, but it's got a peaceful feel to it. Peace Day was a lot of fun. Everyone cheered at the end, even though I missed a few high notes. We should have more events like that, Snake. I'm sorry, Snake. My head hurts. Could you let me rest? Remember Professor Galvez on his instrument during Peace Day? Woo -wee <laughs> Such a funny sound for a musical instrument. He said the Soviets invented it. Everyone sure seemed impressed. Music has no borders. The professor taught me that. Where is Professor Galvez anyway? I'm sorry, Snake. My head hurts. Could you let me rest? to show me, Snake? Who took this? Strange love? Maybe when she rubbed that sunscreen on me. Oh, I'm trying not to remember it. But you know, despite her quirks, Dr. Strangelove is a good person. I wish you'd come and say hello. Snake? Oh, his nuke? He is so cute. I haven't seen him around lately. Where did he get to? He is the official mascot of Mother Base, so he should show his face a little more. Want to know a secret? I saw Miller feeding nuke when no one was looking. here a while. Snake?
I took this while we were fishing. That day, I figured out that it doesn't really matter if you catch a fish or not. Just waiting for a fish together can be the most fun of all. <laughs> oh yeah, Chico got all worked up and almost fell into the sea. When they do some more fishing, tell me, okay? I'm sorry, Snake. My head hurts. Could you let me rest? Got something to show me, Snake? Cayo Pinto! Amanda and I taught Cecile how to make it. She picked it up so fast. I was really surprised. I guess Parisians have cooking in the blood. Are Cecile and Amanda doing okay? I wonder why they haven't visited. I'm so tired. I will just lie here a while. She's been acting differently lately. Before, she'd respond to conversation. Just as long as it didn't conflict with her timeline. But now, nothing gets a reaction from her. What happened? No idea. Well, Miller did go and tell her that Skullface is dead. If anyone should want revenge against him, it would be her. It's not exactly like an angel of peace to cheer for someone's death, now is it? There, take a look at this too. See it? Right there. The wound is open. Yeah. It was all closed up, and then it went back to this. But why? The medic has no idea how it happened. He figures it must have been self-inflicted.
Snake? One of the group birthday parties. They are something to look forward to every month. Miller was so funny at this one. <laughs> when is the party this month? Last month was... I cannot remember. It was... Um... And then I... No, that is not right. But I am an angel of peace. I... I am a student. Uh. Snake? Got something to show me, Snake? The Costa Rican Sea. It is so beautiful. Costa Rica means rich coast. Please, please, get them out of my country. Them? Huh? Who was I thinking of? was um and then i no that is not right but i am an angel of peace i i am a student oh, i am so tired i will just lie here a while Got something to show me, Snake? Chico, I wonder what he thinks of me. I have not seen him lately. Maybe he is angry. There is something I am hiding from Chico. Or I thought there was. It was. Um, and then I... No, that is not right. But I am an angel of peace. I... I am a student. Oh, I am so tired. I will just... 
just lie here a while. <laughs> Got something to show me, Snake? Football. I joined in. And there's Huey refereeing. He said... We have forsaken our countries, and become one with the Earth. It is good being here together with everyone, you know? It was... Um... And then I... No, that is not right. But I am an angel of peace. I... I am a student. Uh, my head, it hurts. never came. Every morning I wake up expecting it to come, but it is always three days away. That cannot be it. 
I have not woken up at all. It's just a dream. It is all a dream. I am in it. And you are in it too. I am the dreamer. But you are having my dream. Do you get it now? You do. Don't you? This day never came. With three days left, I followed my orders from Cypher and launched the operation. I hijacked Zeke. I fought Snake. I lost and was thrown into the ocean. I survived, but I was captured by Cypher. How happy I would have been if they had let me die then and there. Our wishes do not come true. We just cling on to our dreams. Our phantoms. Mine. And yours. But I think this one is coming to an end. After all, you have figured it out now. You can kill Skullface, murder Huey, slaughter Zero, burn the whole world down. And it still won't bring me back. Me, or any of the dead. And that was our business. War. We bought our daily bread with money paid to us for killing. Maybe us getting killed was just balancing the scales. You know, Mother Base was never the heaven we wanted it to be. But I was still happy to have lived with everyone there. It was such a short time. Such a hypocritical peace. But while I was on Mother Base, I was happy. So... I hope I am not the only one who looks back on those days with happiness. There is more to remember than hatred and rage. But of course, this is you thinking that I should think that. It is no mystery now. I am just a phantom. A fragment of the mind you have lost. The real me died a long time ago. But even so, more so, I can tell what you are really feeling. The real emotion that is locked away at the bottom of your heart. Let it fly out. Let it guide you. Live. I think it is my job to tell you that. That is why I exist. So this tape is the last one. Once you are done listening to it, I am one phantom limb that will be gone for good. My flesh, my bones, joining the silt on the ocean floor. But do not forget, as long as you remember me, I will always live within you. Not a phantom limb or a phantom anything, as part of your heart. I will always be your angel of peace. So, I know exactly how to finish. <laughs>